de Cristiano. From a poor boy born in the streets of Madeira to becoming one of the greatest players in the history of football, this is the story of Cristiano Ronaldo. Five Ballon d'Ors, five Champions League trophies, four golden shoes, and the most goals in the history of football. This is more than just football. This is Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo born in 1985, grew up in a poor family on the island of Madeira in Portugal. His father was a gardener and footman for a local football club. His mother even considered abortion due to financial issues. Despite his family's struggles, Ronaldo's talent for football shone through. By 12, he was playing for Sporting CP's Youth Academy in Lisbon. At 14, he was expelled from school and decided to solely focus on football. However, his struggle did not end there. At 15, he overcame a heart condition that could have stopped him from becoming a professional footballer. At 16, Ronaldo was promoted from Sporting's youth team by first team manager Leslo Bologna, who was impressed with his dribbling. Clubs like Liverpool, Barcelona and Arsenal all expressed interest. However, it was Manchester United's Alex Ferguson. Ferguson secured him for £12.24 million. This move would mark the beginning of a legendary career. Manchester United secured a teenage Ronaldo in 2003, making him the club's first Portuguese player and the most expensive teenager in English football history at the time. He inherited the legendary number 7 shirt previously worn by icons like George Best and Eric Cantona, adding pressure but also fueling his ambition. Ronaldo swiftly found a guiding force in manager Sir Alex Ferguson, who would become a crucial mentor throughout his career. In his debut season, Ronaldo faced a lot of criticism from the British press due to his flashy and flamboyant playstyle. However, he quickly delivered results, contributing to an FA Cup win in his first season. His dedication paid off in his breakout 2006-7 season, where he scored 23 goals and had 14 assists in 53 games, which helped him secure his first Premier League title with Manchester United. The next season was even more impressive. He became the first winger to win the European Golden Shoe. His leadership qualities emerged as he captained United and his goals propelled them to the Champions League and the Premier League victories. In the 2007-8 season, Ronaldo scored 42 goals and had 8 assists in 49 games. The next season was the season in which Ronaldo won his first Ballon d'Or and the FIFA World Player of the Year. His match-winning goal in the second leg in his Porto, a 40-yard strike, earned him the inaugural FIFA Puskas Award presented by FIFA in recognition of the best goal of the year. Even though the season was a big success, Ronaldo failed to deliver a United's 2-0 loss in the Champions League final against Barcelona. Ahead of the 2009-10 season, Ronaldo joined Real Madrid for a world-record transfer fee at the time of 80 million pounds. This was the start of the rivalry between the two greatest players of all time, Cristiano Ronaldo and Lionel Messi. In his debut season, he scored an insane 33 goals and had 10 assists in just 35 games. He missed quite a few games due to his ankle injury in October while on international duty, which kept him sidelined for seven weeks. Although he helped Real Madrid amass 96 points in La Liga, they were unable to win the league and he was trophyless for his debut season. The next season was the one where Ronaldo inherited the infamous number 7 jersey following Spanish legend Raul's departure from the club. During the season, Ronaldo performed even better and scored 53 goals and had 18 assists in 54 games. He even scored the match-winning goal in the 103rd minute of the 2011 Copa del Rey final, winning his first trophy in Spain. In the 2011-12 season, Ronaldo helped Real Madrid win La Liga by scoring a monumental 60 goals and 15 assists in 55 matches. In spite of scoring these many goals, he finished runner-up to Lionel Messi in the Ballon d'Or rackets. Ronaldo began the 2012-13 season by lifting the Super Copa de España, his third trophy in Spain. With a goal in each leg, he helped Madrid win the Spanish Super Cup on away goals rule following a 4-4 aggregate draw against Barcelona. The 2013-14 season was a golden one for Ronaldo. He signed a lucrative contract extension and was joined by Gareth Bale, which led to the legendary attacking trio BBC, comprised of Ronaldo, Benzema and Gareth Bale. His goal-scoring prowess continued with hat-tricks across various competitions and 51 goals and 17 assists in 47 games. This individual brilliance was finally matched by team success as he helped Real Madrid achieve La Decima, 
the 10th Champions League title. In this season, he was able to win his first Ballon d'Or in Real Madrid, breaking Lionel Messi's four-year streak. He scored a record 17 Champions League goals and scored the winning penalty in the Champions League final. He became the top scorer in La Liga and shared the European golden shoe with Luis Suarez. In the 2014-15 season, Ronaldo had a record-breaking year. He set his personal best with 61 goals and 23 assists in 54 games and became the fastest player to reach 200 La Liga goals. He also won the Ballon d'Or for the third time. Despite his individual brilliance, Real Madrid finished runners-up in La Liga and exited the Champions League in the semi-finals. He capped off the season by becoming the La Liga top scorer for the second time and won a record-breaking fourth European Golden Shoe. From 2015-18, to 18, Ronaldo established himself as a legend at Real Madrid. He shattered numerous records, becoming the club's all-time top scorer in both La Liga and all competitions. He also became the Champions League's all-time top scorer with a hat-trick against Shakhtar Donetsk. He won three Champions League titles in a row and won the Euros with Portugal in 2016. He won the Ballon d'Or two more times during the 2016-17 season and the 17-18 season. He also helped Madrid win their first La Liga title since 2012. He also won the 2016 and 17 FIFA Men's Best Player Awards. Despite months of negotiation to sign a new Real Madrid contract, on 10th July 2018, Ronaldo signed a four-year contract with Italian giants Juventus after completing a £100 million transfer. Ronaldo won his first trophy with the club on 16 January 2019, the Supercoppa Italiana. In his first season at the club, Ronaldo showed off his skill by leading Juventus to their eighth successive league title, scoring 28 goals and 11 assists in 43 games. In the 2019-20 season, he overtook Rui Costa to become the highest scoring Portuguese player in Serie A history. Ronaldo also managed to lead Juventus to their ninth consecutive league title, scoring 37 goals and having 7 assists in 47 games. Despite a COVID-19 setback in the 2020-21 season, Ronaldo continued his goal-scoring dominance at Juventus. He reached his 750th career goal with a strike against Dynamo Kiev. He became the fastest player to score 100 goals for Juventus in all competitions. He won the Serie A Top Scorer Award with 29 goals and became the first player to win all major domestic trophies in England, Spain and Italy. However, 2021-22 season started with a transfer saga. He held talks with Manchester City but a deal fell through. Ultimately, he returned to his former club, Manchester United. Ronaldo's homecoming to Manchester United was a commercial and initial success on the pitch. Ronaldo rejoined United for a hefty sum of 12.85 million euros. He won Player of the Month for April, was named in the Premier League Team of the Year, received Manchester United's Player of the Year award. However, the team's overall performance was underwhelming, finishing sixth in the league and trophyless. The 22-23 season started off incredibly bad for Ronaldo, with him wanting to leave for United for Champions League competition. No clubs took him up on his offer due to his high wage demands. He fell out with his new coach Eric Ten Hag, leading to tensions and a public interview criticizing the club. United terminated his contract by mutual agreement. This led Ronaldo to sign for Saudi giants Al Nasser. Ronaldo received the highest salary in football history worth £200 million per year. In his first season for Al Nasser, he scored 14 goals and had 2 assists in 16 games. Ronaldo spent another season without winning a league title as Al Nasser finished second in the league in the 2022-23 season. However, in the current season, Ronaldo has been on an insane form, scoring and assisting in every single game and he is undoubtedly the most important player in Al Nasser. He has scored a monumental 30 goals and 11 assists in 33 games and has used his influence to promote Saudi Arabia to new heights by enabling them to sign world-class players like Neymar, N'Golo Kante, Karim Benzema and Sumi Mou. Ronaldo led Al Nasser to their first Arab Club Champions Cup and has been instrumental in their current pursuit of the league title. Cristiano Ronaldo, a name synonymous with greatness, from his humble beginnings in Madeira to becoming a global icon. His journey is a testament to relentless dedication and unwavering belief. He has pushed the boundaries of what's possible, inspiring millions to chase their dreams. But Ronaldo's story is far from over. The fire still burns brightly in him. What will the next chapter hold? Only time will tell. But one thing is certain, Cristiano Ronaldo will continue to defy expectations 
and write his name even deeper into the fabric of footballing history.